So today I'm going to show you how to pass the legs and then follow up with the floating hold, floating hold, ukikatami, and then transition into armbar. So uh, then I'm back on the back. So we, we all know this um, leg nailing pass, you control inside of his pants, put your elbow, your forearm on the shin, come up, nail his legs to the floor, and then pass to the side. So sometimes you may not be able to completely flatten his leg, sometimes you may end up like this. So anyway, make a step out, pass to here. And then a lot of times he's gonna to start to push you, right? So anyway, you wanna keep your leg on his belly. So that's called ukigatami, floating hold. Obviously you wanna hold on to something, maybe hold on to the lapel, hold on to the sleeve, or hold on to his pants. So a lot of times he's gonna to try to push you off. It's when, when he's trying to push you off, okay, you're gonna grab his arm from the inside, spin around to this side, Sit back, put arm lock. So a little bit, in, uh, a bit faster. So from here, come up, push him down, push his here, from here, control with the knee. He's gonna start pushing me. Grab his arm from the inside, spin around, come here from the arm lock. So three techniques: passing, floating hold, and then the arm lock. So you don't want to really be up on his chest. You want to keep your Shin, your knee kind of like around his mid up area. Okay, from here, whatever you get, it's not really free to move. And then you can transition to the arm lock. So from here, you're gonna put the arm lock. Try to keep your weight down just a little bit. Control this, and then as you move around, just make one step and spin around. 